This week on UFO Sightings. Right Local there, resident man. Stu Richford faces what he thinks to be a UFO. Get in the house! In the last two years, Stu Richford of Bristol, Oklahoma, claimed to have seen at least 100 unidentified flying objects. This is his story. All right, uh, go ahead and tell us your name and where you're from. Uh, my name's Stu. I'm from Bristol, Oklahoma. Um, what was your occupation at the time of the sighting? I was working on an old rig down yonder. Where exactly did you see the UFO? Well, I was a Jackson Ranch, so I usually do all my hunting. What exactly did the UFO look like? Well, man, you know everyone knows what a UFO looks like. One of them little sign saucer dealers. <laughs> Sawing around in there and stuff, man. Were you so, under the influence of any drugs or alcohol that night? Ah, oh, no. No, I was sober, man. You can't drink and hunt. Well, you can, but you ain't supposed to tell nobody. <laughs> Johnson Remington from Bristow, Oklahoma. Uh, do you believe that Stu actually saw a UFO that night? Man, that's Stu. I don't know about him, man. That's some bitch. I doubt it, seriously. I have to see it with my own eyes to believe it. Do you believe that he was under the influence of any drugs or alcohol? Well, hell yeah. He's a... He's a alcoholic. Uh... He ain't no good, he's a sack of shit. Does he, uh, do you think he drinks while he hunts, or? Hell yeah, man, he... I was sitting down at the store the other day. About hunting time comes around. He comes in there and gets him a case, says he's going hunting. Dumb son of a bitch. After his interview, Stu informed us that he had footage of the UFO on his hunting camera. Man, I was sitting in my tree back over here. I was hunting. I looked up in the sky. There's a light, man, and it was shooting around everywhere, man. It came down and landed right beside me, man. I ain't never seen nothing like this in my life. All right. It's right over there, man. I gotta get out of here, man. It's freaking me out. Man, we're out here waiting on Stu to get back. We've been over here for like 30 minutes and he locked us out the house, I think. And we're... Hey! Hey! Is that him? Go run! Stu! Get in the house! Get in there! My team tried to contact Stu late in 2009. Sadly, this was the last footage of him. He mysteriously vanished on a hunting trip just months after the interview. His closest friends and family are skeptical as to how he disappeared. However, one thing is clear. Stu Richford saw something that night. And maybe, something saw him. Thank <laughs> you.